Hello everyone, a rather unusual video here. This has been shared online as being an FPV drone with automatic guidance hitting a Russian tank. Now, details are lacking as to what it means by automatic guidance. Whether it's programmed to fly to certain GPS coordinates and detonate, or if it's fitted with some sort of, say, infrared homing device or something like that. The tank is stationary on this video, but I can't really see a GPS guidance for a drone being all that useful as it limits what it can be used against. So I think some kind of maybe heat seeking infrared guidance is most likely. But this tank is stationary and presumably abandoned. Would it really have heat spots from its engine for the drone to home in on? I guess I'll depend on how long it's been empty for. If only for a few minutes or a short span of time, then I expect it would. On the video, the first drone looks like it was suppressed by electronic warfare as the feed goes blank. Yet the drone still hits a target. So this type of technology looks like it reduces the effect of jammers and the like. Now I wonder if rather than the type of heat seeking tracker, it could just simply be programmed with a video memory of what to target. So even if a feed to the operator is jammed, it still zeroes in on what it was being aimed at. I'm not sure if that's possible or not. I don't know much about drones. But I'll definitely be interested to see more of these, maybe against a moving target, see if it can still guide its way on and hit a vehicle moving down a road rather than one that's stationary. So let's see where this is. So the geolocation is on screen now. The tank was in these woods here. Zoomed out, you can see that this is located east of Terny and Yampolivka, west of Kremina. Russia is carrying out an ongoing offensive towards Terny at the moment. Seen here? The tank was about 3 kilometers to the nearest front lines, and zoomed out, you can see it west of Kremina as mentioned, a key area at the moment, and zoomed out here, on the eastern front, heading north. So that's it for this video, hope you found it interesting. Now before we finish, a quick mention about the ongoing fundraiser of Rebirth Energy, to buy a buggy for Ukraine's armed forces. The donation link is in the description. Thanks very much, and take care everybody.